First robotics teams from across the state, including 18 from the UP, are in Escanaba for a two-day competition. Other student groups came to show off their creations. Robots that can pick up and shoot an inflatable ball into a hoop. Robotics team members get first-hand experience in learning engineering and programming computers, which can lead to internships or jobs in the near future. The thing that makes FIRST unique is that you work with mentors. You learn from the pros. You learn what they do on a daily basis. And so you're, being, you're, you're just exposed to these wonderful STEM careers so that you can see if there's something that you're interested in. It also helps with community outreach because it gets more people involved and it gets more people interested in robotics. Like, I know we've gotten a few students like because of somebody talking about it or seeing it. I just kind of heard about it and it sounded pretty cool making robots and stuff. So uh, it's not BattleBots, but it's that still really fun. First Robotics is growing not only in the state of Michigan, but also in the UP. This is the first time Escanaba has hosted a, a competition of their own. We've been waiting for this day for so long and it finally came. We've got enough teams now in the UP that we could actually have an event and have it populated by a lot of UP teams and then other teams from downstate were excited to come as well. So it's really fun. We are so excited to be here. Over 100 volunteers were also on hand to help run the competition. The competition continues until 7 tonight and starts again at 9 a.m. at the Escanaba High School.